It is time to determine the number one contender for the EB, oh, not the EBCW, but for the World Heavyweight Championship, Nitro's big title. I mean, look at the field. Ray, Finn, Matt Riddle, Roman Reigns, former world champion, Samoa Joe, former world champion, uh, Undertaker, former uh, contender for the championship. Bobby Roode has made it quite a case for himself with a couple of wins on and off camera. And Buddy, Buddy Murphy had a great role early on in EBCW. All of these men have some case to the World Heavyweight Championship. On NXT, but, they're, but while they go through hell in the Battle Royal, the big dog. they have to realize they're facing... AJ not in a standard one-on-one -on -one match, but inside Hell in a Cell. So, they not only have to prepare their body from an ass beating they're about to get, and surviving to become contender, they now have to prepare their body for the pain that they're going to feel inside the Devil's Playground, Hell in a Cell. Now, ladies and gentlemen, as I typically like to do, I'm not going to allow myself, or I'm not going to allow you to suffer eight straight entrances for 2k that would just be torturous and I would not allow any of you to go through that so as Roman Reigns makes his entrance I'm gonna cut it off right here and when the match starts ladies and gentlemen we're going to determine a new number one contender for the world heavyweight championship and now we've reached our final contestant here on the Battle Royale Contenders match. I gotta say, man, he's he's one of the dark horse picks. There's a couple of guys that I'm not sure are gonna win this. I'd say my two dark horse picks are Bobby Roode and Buddy Murphy. My more sane picks is definitely gonna be uh, either Samoa Joe or Roman Reigns. Those are my four picks for Dark Horse and guys that I actually think are going to win, which, you know, I, I wouldn't... You should pick Samoa Joe and Roman Reigns. I mean, they were the last... Well, not the last, but they were World Heavyweight Champions in some capacity. And now, let's get it on, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see what's going on here. Samoa Joe is taking The Undertaker to the corner. That's not a really great place to put him. He's apparently trying to eliminate him from the corner already. Rey Mysterio is taking on Buddy Murphy, who is, might as well be his son-in-law on SmackDown, even though they haven't really uh, done anything with that yet. Finn Balor is now going to Rey Mysterio. It's going to be a very brutal match, ladies and gentlemen. Like I said, after this match, they got to prepare for something even worse than what they usually would deal with. And Bobby Roode is going to take Riddle into the corner there. I thought he was going for the power bomb, but I can't say I blame him much. Roman Reigns just got eliminated? Holy shit. I'd have to watch that back. I don't know what happened with Roman Reigns, but Roman Reigns, one of my picks and probably the odds-on favorite, just got eliminated in this battle royal. Oh my lord. I do not believe what I just saw. Bobby Roode got sent over the top, but he is going back. And now he's going to take Riddle out, or try to, because he just tried to wipe him off the floor. Finn Balor is uh, having his own issues. They're both tag-teaming on Riddle. Samoa Joe was taking on... Uh, Rey Mysterio, and Rey Mysterio is uh, doing a little short herd Karana there, driving the face of Joe into the mat. That's all well and good, but that's not really going to help him win the match. It may help him wear him down, but I'd say try and do a 619 or a Hurricane Rana off the top rope there. Bobby Roode goes into the corner, courtesy of The Undertaker. So not a smart move by Rey Mysterio to taunt when he can get thrown over the top rope, but what do I know? And it seems as though, I think it was either Bobby Roode or Finn Balor just eliminated Undertaker, who was another one of a, who could possibly have been another pick. Reversal there by Bobby, and Bobby Roode's wailing on the, on the man that thinks that the wrestling business watches him, not the other way around. Into the corner, Bobby Roode goes. Buddy Murphy is hanging by a thread, and Riddle cannot take advantage of that situation. And there goes Bobby Roode. 
Finn Balor, I think he either has two or three eliminations at this point. Because if I'm not mistaken, he might have been the one to get rid of uh, Roman Reigns. And now both Roman, not Roman, Ray and Finn are trying to eliminate the former World Heavyweight Champion, Samoa Joe. Which ends in epic failure because Samoa Joe is just too big for both men. But of course, Finn and Samoa Joe are no strangers to each other. They had a great feud for the NXT Championship many, many moons ago. Ray fighting both Murphy and... Uh, oh, nice, nice clothesline by Murphy. And Samoa Joe is now eliminated. Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? Finn has like two, three or four eliminations now. I... I don't know what I'm seeing. This man is just going straight ham. Nice kick by Murphy there, though. Murphy, out of the original four picks I had, as Rey Mysterio just eliminates Matt Riddle, out of the four picks I had, Buddy Murphy and Rey Mysterio were two of them. Or, not Buddy Murphy, but Buddy Murphy was one of them. And he's the last one remaining. Both men want this match. They want that opportunity inside Hell in the Cell, and Buddy Murphy may as well have it. After all, he did just eliminate one of the... Probably the best guy in this match in Finn Balor. Nice reversal there by Buddy Murphy. Big knee to the face. That's not going to feel good for Ray. And Ray, the luchador legend, is now going to make him feel a little bit of pain. And reversal by Ray Mysterio. Nice. What's he going to do? What do we got going on here? What is this? A power bomb? Oh, a little short power bomb attempt. I can't say it was all too effective given Ray's height, but we'll see. Suplex. Oh no, three amigos suplex, it seems. Shout out to his homeboy on Raw, the EBCW champion, Eddie Guerrero, but possibly not for long. And now Ray sending Buddy to the corner, or to the ropes, and... Ray Mysterio gets the opportunity to face AJ Styles. What a fucking showing. I thought Finn was going to win this match until he got eliminated by Murphy, and then Ray, in his infinite wisdom, Eliminates the more inexperienced Buddy Murphy. I gotta say, I hope their relationship at home kind of stays, uh, still say, stays cool, given the fact that Buddy is technically dating Aaliyah, his daughter. <laughs> I don't even know if they're actually dating or not, or it's an on-screen thing, but who the fuck knows. Either way, Rey Mysterio is going to face AJ Styles for the World Heavyweight Championship. I'm excited, and what a way to cap off the final Nitro of EBCW 2K20 season. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will catch you all next week. Got a couple things going on for our main event next Friday, so I hope you guys enjoy and stay tuned with me there. You all have a fantastic day.